All right. In an effort to shave some weight off my bicycle, I'm gonna do something bold here and cut my carbon C post. Uh, yeah, it's carbon already, so I'm not gonna be losing much weight, but I'm gonna be losing something. Um, just one quick thing I'd like to point out. I mean, if you do this, do it at your own risk. But uh, this uh, minimum insertion right here is obviously well that tells me that the manufacturer wants at least you know three inches three and a sixteenth sticking into the frame so it might be a little hard to see on the video here but there's a a mark where I've been riding around uh, with my C post so I'm gonna assume that from that mark I'm gonna be three and a six, three inches and a sixteenth down into the seat post. So it looks like I can go ahead and cut it off just under this uh, minimum insertion text. So I'm going to do that now. This miter box here, just a little plastic miter box. And I have a miter saw here. If that doesn't work well, I'm going to maybe try a hacksaw. And, you know, of course, like all things, I'm going to go ahead and start out by. Um, just taking a little bit off. This way if it really gets screwed up I can uh, attempt to cut it a different way. Alright, so after hacking at this for a second, take a look at it. Everything appears to be nice. Looks like it's making a nice smooth cut, so I'm gonna go ahead and uh, I'm gonna go ahead and cut it uh, right where I want it to be this time around. Alright. Doesn't look terrible. There's one spot here where it broke through right at the end. That um, most likely could be sanded off. Just put a little sandpaper flat. Oh, that's pretty. Alright, and there you have a nice smooth cut. On the carbon fiber seat post. It cut off. It is uh, 24 grams. Uh, crazy? I don't know. You tell me. You're the one watching the video on how to cut carbon fiber C posts. So, uh, 24 grams, I mean, that's something. So, there you have it.